Now that your company themes have been set up, you'll be able to build your first email template, which is going to be your blank template, so that you can send a plain text email to any client you add to your system. To do this, go to the engine area of Locked On and in the template, select Add. You'll see the template type is selected as email and we need to give it a label. The label I want you to use is one blank. The reason we give it number one is so it appears at the top of your template list. We then select the add template option. The first thing you'll be able to do is drag in a header. When you drag in a header, you'll be able to select a color logo that you've added to your theme or your white logo. We can see here the white looks nicer, but if you use your color, you could put a nice background black at the top of the screen. You also have a header title that can go at the top right. You can see that we can change this text or we can simply remove it by clearing that field. Once you have set up this, you can hit the save option to save that widget. The next thing you want to do is drag in your paragraph. Now the paragraph will be the standard text that goes below your header. Here we can see it says enter the content, so we're going to type hi. And the first merge code that you'll need to add is called recipient name. This is one that you'll get really familiar with. So we look for the code called recipient name and we can see that it loads in first name, surname. We actually don't need the surname so we can double click this tag and turn off the surname and we can now see it just says hi first name. We can then put a comma after the tag and we can go to the next line to type our standard text. Now I want you just to put type text here. This will remind you that you've got to change the text when you go to send this. We can then hit the save option to save that widget and then we're going to save this template by hitting save. We can see what this looks like by clicking the desktop option to show us what it will look like on a computer when received and also the mobile icon to see what it will look like on a mobile device. Once you're happy, close that down and we can now go to your client's database to send a test. To send a test, we'll go to the client's database and it's always a good idea to have yourself added into the database as a test record so that you can send SMSs and emails to proof them. We're going to open up my test record and we'll go to the send option and select send email. We can see that it's sending to the one person on the record that has an email and then we can go to the next step to choose our template. In our template list we'll see that number one blank is at the top. So this is our standard text template that we want to select and we can see that it loads in hi first name and it says type text here. The widget that we've loaded is also requiring us to put a subject on this. So before we can send it we have to hit customize and we have to add a subject and in here we're going to put test email from locked on. We can then edit the text in the paragraph. So we can see here that it says hi first name type text here. So we're simply going to replace the type text here with a text that we want to send to this particular person. We can now see that I've edited the text and we have our email ready to send. I'm going to save the changes we've made and now that there are no alerts for us to edit we can hit the next step and choose to send this email now from whatever agent we can in our office or in our team. You then hit the send option and this will send the email off to you as a test for you to review. You would follow those steps to send any normal text email off to any client that you put into the database.